What's up everyone, this is Cybernight, and today I'm going to open up the uh, brand new uh, Yukio Circuit Break box for you guys. So yeah, this set is just now officially released, and uh, yeah, I got a box of it, so let's go ahead, open it up, and uh, see what we can get. I mean, I'm looking for a lot of different cards from this set too, so part of the cards hopefully will help us out and get all the cards that we're looking for, right? Or at least closer to them. But yeah, Break the Code is also what it says, by the way. I think that's kind of funny, because Code the Duelist was the previous set. Yeah, of course, uh, I got this from uh, Big and Collectibles, so be sure to check them out. Link in the description. You guys can see, of course, there's their logo. And, uh, yeah, they have Yu-Gi-Oh cards, Pokemon, and other card games, too. So be sure to check them out. Also using my new microphone on this video, too. So I have to kind of remember to actually talk into this microphone. It doesn't really follow me as well. But, yeah, see what we get from our packs. All right, first pack. What do we have here? have one of the crawler monsters, a lot of them actually. I might actually build them, I've had requests. We have Vendred Knights, that is the field spell. I think that gives me three of them now, got a play set. And a twin triangle dragon, good rare. The Amazonas and everything too. Not a bad start. I need a few of the, the link monsters that are rares in this set. So hopefully we'll hunt a bunch of them down. The crawler monster for us. And uh, we have Link Bumper. Okay, I could tell it was a Link Monster at least. So, got another one of those too. Got that from the sneak preview. And also uh, Metaphys uh, Tyrant Dragon. Supposedly someone told me it's, it's pronounced Metaphys instead of Metaphys. So, I'll try to say it that way if I remember correctly. And uh, hopefully that's the right pronunciation. I don't know, but I, I want to get these cards. So, I'm hoping I get the, the rest of them that I need. Not many people are really looking to build Metaphys, so... I'm hoping they'll all be cheap so I can build them, because they're one of my favorite archetypes lately. Got one of the rocket monsters. I still love that duck dummy. <laughs> Just love that. And there we go. We have, uh, I guess it's like a, a sim metaphys, I guess is how you say that, or is it a sim metaphys? I, I don't know. I'll go with both pronunciations. I could be wrong on both of them, but this is a card I definitely needed, so just need one more of these. I got one from Sneak Preview, and here's my second one. And then after that, we have uh, Fire King Avatar uh, Avarta, I guess. So that's cool. Keep thinking of like Smite or something whenever I see that. And I want to say just like Ganesh or Ganesha or however you say it. One of the characters I play a lot of on Smite. I'm usually a Guardian on that game. Maybe I got one of the Ultra's I needed. There's a uh, uh, Miss Starboy. Yeah, he's actually a common. I was kind of surprised on that. And we have Auto Rocket Dragon, super rare. That's another rocket monster I needed. As well as uh, Ventured Reunion. I don't know if I got that from Sneak Preview or not. Hopefully, we get all the Link monsters, though, that I'm looking for. Maybe even that Spiral? Possibly? <laughs> yeah, I wonder how much fun that's going to be to get. Oh, well, there's one of the Luna Lights. And we have a uh, Quiet Life. I don't think I got that one yet. Super rare. As well as uh, a Personal Spoofing. One of the Altergeist cards. And there's the other Luna Light. Very nice. Yeah, I'm thinking I'll probably build them, make like at least a fun build for them. Since they got their last cards, finally. Took a while. <laughs> but I guess they're they're here now, at least. And, uh, oh, I thought that was going to be the hollow. And we have Altergeist uh, Protocol, as well as uh, Backup Squad. Got, I think, both of the Luna Lights in that pack, too. Not bad. Let's see, another one of uh, Mr. Our Boy. I love that he's a common. And there we are. We have Borrowload Dragon. Okay, I saw it was late monster. I was like, nah, we're not going to get our secret rare, are we? There it is. Okay, I'm glad I got this one too. I need a few of these, actually, because I want to build rockets. And I'm kind of sad that a bunch of the rocket cards are actually secret rares. They look cool, but it's going to be fun to hunt down. But at least I'm getting closer to it. So, yeah, we got the main card, and this is one I definitely wanted to get. So, that's awesome. And also, Samurai Destroyer. I haven't got this card yet. This is a new Synchro Monster. It's a world premiere, so it was added to our version of Circuit Break. It's actually really good. It's a machine like synchro monster and it's kind of like colossal fighter sort of is what it reminds me of. So that's actually awesome to get too. But I'm so happy we got Borlo Dragon. He looks awesome. He's kind of I guess like the new blue eyes white dragon for for this series. There's always that 3000 attack, you know, rivals monster. 
so I had to get that. Let's see. Oh, we got one of the crawlers, the, the Link Monsters. They actually have quite a few that are low rarity. And Gateway Dragon. That's a good super rare. As well as uh, Metaphys uh, Dimension. Good trap card, too, by the way. I run two of those in my build. So I think I'm all set with those now. I think I just basically need another one of the, the Ultra Rare, and I might have everything for Metaphys then. Again, I hope I'm saying that right. And uh, we have the new Trickstar. Trickstar uh, Black uh, Cat Bat. So, yeah, that's a weird name. I was kind of had to say that over my head a few times. Like, is that the name? Uh, yeah, that is an Ultra Rare, too. That's pretty cool. And Dragonoid Generator. Just have to get one of the Secret Rares that I needed. If I can get another one of the Rocket Secret Rares, that will really make me happy. Another one of Squib Draw. I think I need, like, a couple of those. Again, that'll be fun to hunt down. We have Vendred Knights, another one of those, and uh, Fantastic uh, Streborg. At least it seems like Vendred Knights is really easy to get, huh? All right, there we go. If I can get to focus, there. Okay. Well, we have Metaphys uh, Ragnarok. That's one I needed, too. I think that gives me a playset now, so... That will come in handy. And Trickstar uh, Narcissus, I guess. There, and this is the last one. Yeah, last one for the right side of the box. Is it going to be another Ultra Rare? I think. Hopefully, we'll see. New Marmel. And we have number 41, uh, Bakus or Bagusaka, the Terribly Tired Taper. <laughs> That's kind of tough to say if you think about it. But yeah, we finally got a new number monster, number 41. This is actually a really good card and another one for the numbers collection. Might be able to do an update now if you guys would like to see that. I got the other like Utopia monster I was missing too. It's like it's like S0 or something, Utopia. It's, it's one of the different ones that they, they have in Japan that we don't have yet. So I guess I could do an update now. I still don't really like his changes, though. I wish, you know, he's supposed to be, like, an alcoholic, I guess, really. But, uh, yeah, they censored the artwork, as you guys can see. And, of course, we have Metaphys uh, Daedalus. Not bad. Yeah, he's actually supposed to be drunk. So, they had to change that for some reason. I'm surprised they didn't, like, change it to hot sauce or whatever, like they did in GX. Think that was right? Yeah. We have Quiet Life and Metaphys uh, Dimension. There's Ojama Duo. Actually, a pretty good card. At least we're getting a few different Ojama cards lately. I still want them to get like a Link Monster or something, or Exceed, or something that can help them out. Luna Lights, Miss Star Boy, and we have Alter Geist uh, Protocol. And also, we have Personal Spoofing, so double the Alter Geist cards. Come on, hard the cards. Help us out here. Let's get that Spiral Link Monster. I actually want to build Spirals, but, I'm, you know, they're, they're uh, well, on everyone's radar now, of course. Well, there we go. There's a new Goki card, uh, Goki uh, Thunder Ogre. I was thinking about I might do an update for my Goki build as well, just because, well, they gained two new cards, really. The Link Monster and, of course, the Common that we've gotten a few of. So, I don't know. Might be fun to do that. And finally, I got this card, uh, Destrodo, the Lost Dragon's uh, Fruition. This card is awesome. Like, I've been waiting on this one for quite a while. I'm still shocked that it was actually a rare for us because I thought they would make it a secret rare. I was afraid of that. And, yeah, so it's actually easy to get. Works really well with a lot of different decks. It's like an instant level 7 synchro monster when you use it. And it works really well with Dragon Ravine. So guess what I'm going to try it out with? Exactly. Got to bring back those Dragoonities. We have three Dragon Ravines. You think I forgot about that? Alter Geist uh, Siliquis, I guess. And also uh, Dragonoid Generator. Still hoping we get something good for our other secret rare. Another one of the crawlers? I don't think we've gotten like the super rare crawler yet. Oh, Link Bumper. Okay, I, I thought I was about to get it after I said that. <laughs> well, okay. That's a different Link Monster. And Alter Geist uh, Camouflage. Not too far away from that uh, 
Cyber Structure Deck. I guess it's, what, two weeks away now? Looking forward to that. The Accumulator. There's the other Goki monster, by the way. And uh, Metaphys uh, Nethides. Very nice. I think that might give me a play set of all of them now. Again, I think I just need another one, the Ultra Rare. And Backup Squad. A lot of Crawler monsters, too. I guess at least it looks like crawlers are going to be pretty much budget, or from what I'm seeing. So that might be fun. And we have Squib Draw. There we go. That that was one of the secrets I was actually wanting from this set. Like I said, going to have to hunt down the rocket cards, and this is one of them I needed. So there we go. This is actually my second one now, because I got one from Sneak Preview. So we're getting there. <laughs> we're getting closer, right? That's awesome, though. And a Vendred Reunion. I'm happy, though. At least, like I said, we're getting closer to building rockets. I really hope they're not expensive since this set is actually out now. I, I don't know. I hadn't really looked up the prices. Heart of the Cards, help us out, though. Because I do plan on getting more boxes of this set. And Subterra Behemoth Fiendus. I, I get a few of those. I, I like this card, by the way. And, of course, Trickstar uh, Narcissus. That's cool. I still think that's really cool looking. I wish it was as good as the you know, the spiral link monster, but it's still a pretty good sub terra monster. Might do an update with them. I was kind of thinking I might wait until they get their, you know, the promo that Japan got in English, but I don't know. I might be able to go on ahead and do something. And there we are. There's the other link monster I want a spiral double helix. So we actually freaking got this. That is awesome. Yeah, of course, you guys know spirals are really scary lately, and this is one of the cards that really helps out with that too, so I'm not sure if I'm going to build Spirals or not, I've been debating on it just because I know I need a couple more Firewall Dragon, but uh, we'll see, at least I'm a little bit closer if I plan on building them, so it looks awesome too, I love the artwork on this card, and it's a really good card for them too, and also World Legacy World Armor, but yeah, I'm so happy we got this, and uh, that it's not a secret rare, I really thought it would be a secret rare for us, just because, you know, you know how Konami does, I was shocked whenever... They showed that it was going to be an ultra rare. Because I figured it would be like secret rare and it'd be like one per case or something. You know, something ridiculous. And uh, Metaphys uh, Executioner. Super rare. And also Metaphys uh, Daedalus. Again, I hope that is the correct pronunciation. I'm sure I will hear if, it, if it's not, right? <laughs> there we go. The Mermill again. And we have Alter Guys uh, Siliquis, as well as One Time Passcode. That's the other Crawler Monster. Like I said, I'm still missing the, the one. I think it's a Super Rare. The one that looks like a Dreamcatcher. And all right, we're down to our last pack. What can we end with? Can we end with, I don't know, something above Super? I think we might have gotten everything, but let's see. Heart of the Cards, help us out here. Wouldn't mind an extra. Or maybe I'll get that Crawler monster, like I said. On the FA monsters, rockets, duck dummy, and World Legacy Trap Globe. <laughs> that's the one that I kept getting from Sneak Preview as well. It's one I would start off openings and end openings with, so that's actually kind of fitting. So, yeah, that's uh, the trap card that we... That's our last hollow, I should say, and Metaverse right afterwards, too. So double trap cards, that's what threw me off. I'm starting to talk about different traps now, but still a uh, really good card to get, too. It's, if terraforming ever does get hit on our ban list, you're definitely going to want to have some of these Metaverse. But yep, there we go. That's the opening. I hope you guys have enjoyed. Here's a recap of all of our hollows. I think we did really well for our box. I mean, we got the Spiral Link Monster. I got a bunch of rocket cards that I needed, Metaphys as well. And uh, yeah, I'm not disappointed at all, to be very honest. So I'm hoping my other boxes will work out as well. And uh, yeah, like I said, I just need another one of the uh, Metaphys uh, Ultra Rare. And for rockets, I need quite a few cards. So I'm hoping I'll be able to hunt them down. And like I said, I plan to get like probably two more of Circuit Break at least, and uh, hopefully we'll get everything we need. So yeah, there you go. Hope you guys have enjoyed this video. As always, thank you guys for watching. Be sure to hit that like button if you enjoyed this video, as well as subscribe for more Yu-Gi-Oh! openings. Of course, anything new that comes out for Yu-Gi-Oh! I do openings on. And actually, just yesterday, I opened up the next set that's coming out after Circuit Break, which is Extreme Force. It just came out for Japan, so we did the Japanese opening, and it'll be out, I believe, February 2nd for us in English. So when it's out in English, you guys know I will definitely do an opening for it, sneak preview and all that stuff as well. 
well. So if you want to stay updated with everything new with Yu-Gi-Oh, whether it's news, openings, discussions, just different things like that, be sure to subscribe. And of course I will catch you guys later. See ya.